Hello everyone, welcome back to Dead Air. We're e playing Somnium Files again. So b before we're going to say the uh, the recap, there's actually <laughs> a technical difficulty. Ah yeah. And we lost a just a short. Uh, I think it was just 15 minutes. Yeah, we, we basically already just saw looked this out. area. Yeah. Mm. But no, we'll we'll again. Yeah, let, let but it's, it's pretty short. Mm. I just interact it normally. But it appears that much time has passed. Years oh. at least. Oh yeah, recap. So to recap, so what just happened? Um we wait what up oh yeah we somnium to gen we because he has the last piece to terror's challenge so, uh, yeah the balloons yeah the balloons and then and footprints in the blood which is all about this and then while there and then when we solve the pieces we we were given that we... there's something underground in it's a power switch. Harder power switch. Power switch. Is, it mm. is it a light switch? No. It looks a little big <laughs> there than a light switch. Mm. <laughs> Perhaps it powers the entire room. Could be. Mizuki, there is a power line that leads to it from above. Follow the x ray. It's the door we came from. Right. <laughs> A power switch and an electrical line leading away from it. The line splits in two. <clears throat> okay, that's weird. The power line in the ceiling leads to the other side of this wall. And if you follow it further... There is something and in this And there it wall. is. Is it a switch? Yeah, by pressing this part here, it turns on. A hidden switch. What happens if I press it? It looks as though it powers. I think a it crashed area. when you pressed it <laughs> last time. I think that's what is that's when the blue piece? screen happened. It is the first yeah. molar of the upper jaw. It does not appear. Uh, yeah, you figured out, out this tooth is from. Uh, from I was don't it? know. Not figured. I just I guess that it's from Dune Fury because. When we found his first half in Studio de Vita as Ryuki, there was missing tooth. There are no marks on the oh. tooth's enamel. Then how? Perhaps the owner of this tooth was punched in the face. Whose tooth is it? Unknown. Let us call this person T for now. T for tooth, of course. <coughs> is it a T he or a T she? There's a square hole here. It is a foot switch, similar to those used at hospitals to open emergency doors. You can use your foot to trip the switch, leaving your hands free. But it does not appear to be powered currently. If I want to use this switch, I've got to feed it some power. And one more thing. There are footprints around the switch as well. The same prints from the bloodstains. These prints are also old. Likely <laughs> There's a door on the other side of the plate, and perhaps a hidden secret beyond it. <clears throat> I wonder if the air is being ventilated properly. It's stale in here. We are underground. Mm. The airflow is likely quite poor. No, that's not it. I don't know how to explain it, but there's bad air down here. Somebody fired it. Hmm. Going to the ventilation system. This is the direction we came from. So there must be something past this wall, too. Some kind of space that would need air to be exhausted. A room. There's an iron plate above the door. What's that doing here? Perhaps some sort of shutter. If that plate came down, the door would not be able to be opened. Hmm. Okay. Oh. oh. Hmm. We have collected all the ingredients. Ingredients for what? You don't know? Judging by the clues, 
something occurred in this space many years ago. Someone, let's call them X, came to this room and did something. If oh, we can follow we what X did, we here. can discover new information. Huh. Oh. Anyway, just answer my questions. Okay, let us begin. What do you think X did first when they came to this room? When they came gave here, it to the you. The power was already on. But it's probably not always like that. An astute assumption. He's gonna give it to we you. We need wow. to restore power to the entire room first. We will not be able to proceed without it. <clears throat> and next okay. is... What did X do after turning on the power? He, uh, smacked the bitch and... Knocked out a tooth? No. Consider the footprints. Those footprints were made in blood. Therefore, X used the foot switch after someone started to bleed. Why would they do that? <coughs> Isn't this a molar? Aren't you supposed to put the tooth under your pillow? Mizuki, how old are you? Okay. I am positive. There are no bloody footprints <coughs> under the switch. Therefore, someone, most likely T, was not yet bleeding when the switch was pressed. Maybe this is a dumb question. How do you know the switch was pressed? Because of how the foot switch is wired. There are two power lines within the tube. Electricity comes from here and then goes back up the ceiling and ultimately terminates in the foot switch. We can leave the foot switch be for now. Let us move on to the next step. After pressing the hidden switch, what do you think X did next? Yes, I... When T got their tooth knocked out, they started bleeding. That's what caused the puddle of blood. Right. Then, X stepped in the puddle, causing the prints. <clears throat> the finishing touches. It goes without saying what X did last. Correct. There are bloody footprints near the switch. It is clear that X came here after T started bleeding. Power is sent here by turning the hidden switch on. Therefore, if you were to trip the switch with your foot... Okay. And now yeah. we know what X did. Prepare the reenactment! Ugh, oh. this again? <laughs> are you ready? Um... Okay, here we go. I didn't say yes. The camera is rolling. Ready? Action! My name is Mr. X. I came here for a certain reason. Yes, yes, <laughs> keep that energy up. What did X do for- First, I need to turn on the power. And then... Do this to the hidden button. And so, the foot switch should have power now. Stop, Mizuki. You forgot something. Oh, right. I need to punch T. Though, I still don't know exactly why. Anyway. hi -ya! <laughs> Hmm. Okay. I find yes. it hard to and believe that Horadori was the one who did this. And lastly, I mean, he was so short. How would he be able to punch out Jin Furui? Yeah. I don't know what, but Chikara Horadori. <laughs> Let us leave the VR world behind and do the. Well, he had, he did world. have a big head. Yeah. <laughs> Even though I still don't get why you had to record that, I think I get the picture. Chikara, Chikara, headbutt. Okay. Step on that thing. I put my phone on the switch. Then. Oh, wait, where's. Just... Oh, there's Lian. Oh, yeah, Lian is here. I forgot that we asked we ask him for help for to unlock the bathroom here, Dory. 
Oh. No. Oh. Hello. Oh, we found the other half of Tokiko now. It can't be. What is this? Can we actually look inside? Oh. Mizuki, what did you do? I guess what you did doesn't really matter. It's the corpse. It's Tokiko Shigure from Nice Japan. Her left half. What is she doing here? But how should I know? Weren't you the one who made her show up? I mean, I guess. <clears throat> You look good, you okay? I'm freaking out after all this. I'm on the brink here. The omelet rice I ate yesterday is already up in my throat. Oh. Uh. <laughs> <coughs> this does solve one big mystery. What? All of the victims of the HB case were cut at the molecular level. Those cuts were likely performed by this machine. So this oh. is some kind of slicer? Exactly. Do you see that wire on top of the machine? Oh! That is CNT, a uh. braided carbon nanotube. The diameter is about 0 0.4 <laughs> nanometers. <coughs> okay. A single nanometer is one billionth of one meter, so it is not visible to the naked eye. But I can see it. That is because I am modifying your vision. I am emphasizing it on purpose for your benefit. So you're saying... That carbon nanotube was used to bisect all the victims? That is highly probable. So all the murders took place? Here, most likely. Including Tokiko. But why are there two machines? Well, unknown. Well, at least we know how they were cut. Well, if there's only two, what did they use for um, uh, Kamiji? Huh. We didn't. Why his other uh, half machine? isn't here. They do not serve different functions. They both look to be exactly the same. Hmm. Okay. Her estimated time of death is 1900 yesterday. Yesterday meaning the 12th. It is currently 1 a.m. on the 13th. So roughly six hours ago. Hmm. But why? Oh yeah, yes. Mizuki. Look at her wrist. Slit wrists. I do not believe this was self-inflicted. The cut is deep, but there are scars as well. Perhaps she did try to take her own life in the past. Okay. Mizuki, what are we gonna do with the body? I can't just leave her, but... I need to see what's on the other side of that door first. You're really gonna go? Yeah, why? What if the murderer is in there? Terror? All the more reason to go. Wow. You're really courageous. You're younger than me, but... I respect you. Leon, you should wait here. What? If that iron plate drops down, I might get trapped again. Oh, right. Okay. Ooh, okay. Wait, you're just gonna leave the two of us here? The one and a half of you, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, gotta keep going. If I get trapped, help me out, okay? Yeah, I got it. <clears throat> is this supposed to be Terra's room? What is this place? Okay, hold on, just a sec. My dog yeah. needs to please get in. Dog. Oh. Woof woof. <coughs> okay, I'm back. Bed, refrigerator, shower, <laughs> toilet. Is someone living here? More like confined here. Look at the door you came in from. There is no handle. It cannot be opened mm. from this side. Good thing Leon is on the other side. 
If we were all trapped in here together, within I a week, feel like Leon's gonna die. An and then, ha! If that happened, I would have beaten him to death. Anyway, we should search the room. Okay. 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 That's the only vent. It is safe to assume the average human could not enter or exit through there. Oh, below, okay. Hold on, hold on. Maybe, maybe there's something important up there. Hold on. Can I go up here? Sofa. TV. Go, Raimi. The drum. Tire. Oh, no. Oh! It's what a is that? It's one of the dumb. It's one of the bombs. You've seen this before? Of course. How could I forget? This is what caused my left eye. And Kizzy. Oh. It is a thermite bomb. Six years ago, a thermite reaction caused Jin Furroway's right half to burn. I know. I read the report. Basically, a miniature version of this was set in the body, right? Correct. PS4. Oh, no, no, never mind. <laughs> There's other stuff. Shady-looking computer. Iva, can you take a look? On it. Oh, is it? Oh, Internal it's data has been analyzed. Mizuki, take a look at this. Is this? It uh... is the Nirvana trial video. There are backups mm. and working files on this computer as well. It seems as though that video was produced here. I think he's using uh Premiere. <laughs> and one more thing, there was some unedited QR footage as well. But that means yes. What is this? I turned the page. This is what was written here. I've been here for ages. I I've trapped here suffering. It's all their fault. They took so much from me. They used my creation without permission. And I'll never for uh, and I'll never forgive them for it. Just writing about it makes me furious. I want to kill them. It's a diary. There aren't daily entries, <sighs> but it seems like the person who lived here wrote it. There might be some clues to the case. Let's keep reading. Okay. Is this where Terry lived? Might be. I like them. Mom is really nice. She taught me a lot of things. Nice is wonderful. Oh. Is the. Is is the, is, it might be Tokiko's daughter? This word is a lie. Oh? These things happening to me are a lie. Mom said that. <clears throat> hold on. <clears throat> mom said that she's going to tell the truth to everyone. I want to help mom. I love mom. But why, <clears throat> why are you nice to him, mom? I hate him. He needs to pay. There Genius. is a date here. This is from six years ago. Oh, six years ago. Okay. They bought it in night. He came. He came this morning. I thought he was. Uh, I thought he was here to mock me. He always speaks on me, but he he said that's not why he was here. He said he wanted to apologize. I'm sorry for everything I've done. I've heard him say it a million of times. Things turned red all of a sudden. Next thing I knew, he was on the ground. I think I hit him. He was bleeding from the mouth and unconscious. I thought he was my chance. I knew how to get the machine out. He basically taught me everything. I took the machine out and set the body in. Split in half. I to be split in half alive. This description. It is similar to what we reenacted earlier in the room next door. So the person yeah. writing this diary was X, and he is probably T. He got his tooth knocked out. The body and I continue. Mm. As I look at this dead body, I thought to myself, "Wait, hold on. Wait, hold." Gun? Just a sec, just a sec. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, 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 no,
Oh, is there no information where he died? Fuck. Wait, lang. Um. Shibuya. What is Shibuya? Oh wait. Just a sec. Just a sec. Come on. Any information about when he died? Because maybe, I think I remember that Gene. Wait. We found but somewhere in February in 10. Appendix again. Half body serial killings. Oh. Lower right. Oh, there. What's your name? No, I don't think so. Damn it. Oh, here. Is there no date? Nah. Fuck. Mm -hmm. nah, I don't think there's that. Fuck. I. Yeah, I think this is Jin. <coughs> uh, if I use. Mm -mm, okay. If I use this, I can help mom. I've been planning this for a long time. But when I saw that, that body, the lights came on. The intersection between the warp and web. That's where the sims can occur. By creating that, the people of this world, Moksha. Is there more? Oh, that's it. Oh, wait. Oh, shit, oh, shit. That's new. Before the earlier morning, I want, to, I want to go see mom. I told you about my plan. She agreed. She even said I can use her money. This, this, has, uh, this has got to work. Ah, mom, you're so kind. Then you know, then you never initiative. I'm going to make it a reality. I decided to proceed with a plan. I thought of a new name for myself. My name is Terra. I will start a new life with this new name. Yeah. So this was Dahlia Boat? Yeah. Um. Maybe? It's totally continue. How ironic. The one thing I needed was being created in this- Ah! Uh, was being created in this very facility. TC Purge. Such a wonderful finalist. But I was told it was still imperfect. More time was needed. No need to no need to be rushed. I decided to wait with mom. Fortunately, there are tons of nice uh, nice members among the researchers. When I told them about the plan, they happily obliged. Ah, I can't wait. It's gonna it's going to be so much fun. Is there more? Everybody tent. Someone interfered. I put it I put it there but it was gone. In suffer for ingrid. No mercy, no mercy, no mercy, no mercy. I'll find you and I'll kill you. Is there more? Oh god, it's, it's going. February 12th, I found you. Filthy thief. Okay, third thief. I cut that thief in half and then set it... Oh, I think he's... I think he's talking to Chikara. I cut that thief in half mm. and then set it up. Your fault, they didn't give it back. The undone, the undone, eh, the undoing is done. I can finally relax. February 13th. The thief <sighs> cut in half. The thief must be. What did I continue? I met the person of my destiny. What? What? Person of my destiny? The diary ends on 2.13. It's oh. all from six years ago. So the diary ends there. Oh fuck, that was a progress? Okay, fine. Anyway. We now understand. The person that was being held here is the culprit of the HB case. If we wait here, will they come back? I do not believe they will. Once they reach the stairs, they will know someone intruded. And will try to get rid of said intruders. If they did, a certain someone would be gotten rid of first. Leon, uh, we need to get dead. now! Leon's dead. Oh. We're back in the abyss. How about last night? Sorry, but I don't want to get involved. Oh, he's still alive. You're going home. No. Oh, I waited at in uh, I waited at the institute until the investigation came, crew came. When they got when they got here, I continued to investigate the place. Now here I'm at a base HQ. <clears throat> Hmm. 
Wow, you really outdid yourself, sneaking in without a warrant. Ugh. Um, I'm sorry, boss. Aiba, you need to keep an eye on her. I am functioning just fine as Mizuki's left eye. I should be <laughs> rewarded for the work I did last night. Yeah, I wouldn't have found that room without Aiba. <sighs> True. What you found was worth bending the rules a little. But this should still warrant a punishment, you know? Boss, I suggest leniency. Mizuki had a strong, personal reason for wanting to search Horidori Institute. The gene therapy? Boss, you knew? Who do you think I am? I know my subordinates so well, I could tell you how many moles they have from memory. So, did you know that Daddy and Mom weren't my real parents? Yeah. Hmm? What is it? Oh, I was just... Thinking about something, something mom told me once. You! I wish you had never been born! Oh, yeah. I was thinking about that. Didn't tell you about. Her parents were. Mm -hmm. Her parents were really mean. Assholes. <laughs> Do you think she meant to say, I wish we never adopted you? What about you, Mario? Oh, don't you hate it how at beauty salons they make you sit in front of the mirror after getting your head shampooed? Okay. Okay. It's Aiba. She's out of my socket now. Okay. How about nice? Okay, I'll give you the rundown. Six years ago, after the incident at the cathedral, oh. the armed vigilantes scurried under whatever rocks they could find across the country. Their group was forced underground. It is thought that they are still active, despite our investigations yielding little results. And of course, we interrogated everyone we caught as hard as we legally could. We got a search warrant for Nice, looked through all their documents. But we could not find any incriminating evidence. That's why Nice is still kicking today. They are as cunning as they are ruthless. About the diary. Terror's diary. I read it too. There's a ton we can get from it. But the most intriguing thing is the Nirvana Initiative. How are the HB case and that plan related? There is still much we do not understand. We do not know who Terror is and why they were imprisoned there. What the blood? Ah, oh, right. <clears throat> Regarding the blood around the slicer, we tested it for DNA matches. Jin Furaway. I got it! <laughs> Yay. Chikara Horidori. Oh. Yonaharu Enda. AKA Andy's Komeji. Oh, I think they're oh. I think they're just saying the victims of the machine. Maybe. Tokiko <laughs> Shigure and one more. One more. One more. One more. Who? Yeah, five different DNA. But we don't know who the fifth person was, which means there might be another yet undiscovered victim. Oh no. Oh, progress. Anyway, I'm gonna go do some investigating. Maybe it was Dahlia Bo. Wait, you haven't gotten any sleep. You should rest first. You're kidding, aren't you? That look in your eyes is telling me to keep fighting through it. <laughs> you know me very well, Mizuki. Where do you plan to go? Well, let's see. I think I want to start by talking to Lian. Maybe there was something he noticed that I overlooked. And next, Shoma. I haven't been able to ask him about the one-wheeled robot yet. And then Mame. I think Mame knows something about the Nirvana Initiative. I'm getting a feeling that this is connected to something bigger. Nirvana Initiative. Understood. I have confirmed their locations. Lian is at Ion, Shoma is at home, and Amame is at Brahmin. I want to gather more information too. I've got to go to Lemniscate, Devita, and Marble. Understood. Let's get going. Don't push yourself too hard, Mizuki. Sir, yes sir. Okay. That's oh. what he said to him, uh, Ryuki. Look uh, what happened to him. <laughs> Plus, do you get along with your daughter? Well, we're not <clears throat> blood related either. She's adopted? Yeah, but we get along well. That's nice. I'm kind of jealous. Some families run deeper than blood. Yeah, I know, but I didn't even get along. You have other relationships, right? Mizuki, you do have a lot of friends. And most importantly, a boss who's reliable and kind. Kind? <laughs> I am kind! If an elderly woman was trying to cross the street, I'd stop cars for her. You could also carry her. Thanks, you too. Mm. Okay. Let's... Oh. Okay, yeah. Let's go see Choma. 
How is he? Look, we didn't find the other half of the Meiji, so... Yeah, not yet. Katatsu's Probably gonna pop best. up in front of him. Mm -hmm. I don't know Which anyone who will use them during the summer. <laughs> uh, hey, Mizuki! Can you not barge into my place and use my kotatsu? He it barely changed. Yeah, it barely changed. What? It's nothing. What the heck? Wait. Is he taller? Is it? Does this have something to do with his genetics? Maybe. I wanted to ask something. Do you have time right now? Shouldn't you have asked that at the front door? It's the Katatsu's fault for being here. Katatsu, bad girl. Uh huh. How old are they supposed to be now? I don't know. <laughs> I forgot uh, Shoma's age. Uh, do you have a nice car? Oh, yeah. Let's wing sync him. Oh, it's an option. I like. I mean, like. I'm still not over it, you know. I'll show them justice. Ooh. Shoma. Where are you? Oh. Um. <clears throat> it's Shoma. It hasn't changed since the first time I met him. Yeah, it barely changed. How are you? Can't you tell? I can't tell by looking, which is why I'm asking. Sometimes I talk to you thinking you're down, but you're doing well. Other times I think you're in a good mood, but you're not. Well, I'm normal. I'm not like having fun or anything. That's the Shoma I know. What? <laughs> You're weird. Uh, how do you know about nice? Yeah, of course I know. Because... Uh... I used to be a member. What? It was a while back. I'm not with them anymore. But you know about nice pretty well then. I guess so. I know about their philosophy. Uh, about Nirvana Initiative. That I don't know too well. I know the Nirvana trial. The video. I continue to ask Shoma about Nice, but he knew nothing more than I already knew. Um, was camping fun? It's a change of pace. I don't have good memories of this season. I came back, and there was a ton of commotion with what happened. Is that why you're here, Mizuki? I guess you could say that. Uh, that robot. Oh, this? After coming back from camping, I found that the one I made earlier was missing. So I'm making a new one. Oh! It went missing. Was it stolen? I don't know. It's not like it's gonna move on its own. So I'm guessing it was taken. I don't know who would go through the trouble. How many people knew about the robot? Only people close to me. Ah, well, I did show that Ryuki guy when he came to question me. Ryuki? Um. It does not seem like Shoma is lying. He most likely has no idea that the robot was used at the stadium. Oh, um, huh. Aiba, have you noticed anything <clears throat> off with Shoma? I do not believe he is lying about anything, and his appearance does not tell me anything. It's good that he wasn't caught up in all this mess. But why was Shoma's robot used to carry Jim's left half? That is still unknown. We still don't know if it actually was his robot, right? True, but... Hey, Mizuki, can I ask you a question? Yes? Did you ever find oh. out how it was done? Hold on. Oh, hold on. Six years ago, Jin Furaway's right half went up in flames out of nowhere, right? Did you ever find out how it was done? Yeah. Oh, well, the body had a small thermite bomb inside it. It was set up so the bomb detonated on a timer. I see. Why do you ask? No reason. Aren't you on the clock right now? You're gonna get scolded if your boss finds out. Ugh. Shoma is right. <laughs> you need to work like a breeding horse to keep boss off your back. What? <laughs> you need to work like a draft horse. <laughs> I thought I heard something else. <laughs> You're not doing anything under the kotatsu, are you? No! What? Sorry. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Okay, um, next to Ion. <laughs> Who do we find here? Where is the Oh! There he oh, is. There he is. Hey, Mizuki, something is wrong. Huh? You do not have to worry about it. I can do this on my own. Sorry, Kizzy. I didn't mean to upset you. I'll head home. But if there's anything you need, just call me, okay? I'll fly right over. Are you pitying me? 
What? On that day six years ago, I became disabled. I used to love dancing, but I can never dance again. You apologized so many times. You said you were sorry you couldn't protect me. That must be why you stay by my side. I have burdened you with that guilt. Am I right, Leon? No! Kizzy! Uh... Ugh. What are you doing? Putting an end to this. <sighs> Mizuki. Big sis. Kizzy... She must have been through hell. She was only putting up a facade. The signs were there during the wink sink the other day. Those repressed emotions mm. must have finally boiled over. I apologize. I wish you hadn't seen that. Leon, it seems to be lower spirit than usual. No, oh, I uh, made Kizzy upset. She said that I'm only with her because I feel guilty. And I told her that's not true. But I guess words aren't enough. Mizuki, have you forgotten why we are here? We are here to ask Lian about yesterday. That can wait. I can't just leave these two like this. I want to see them get along. How? Well... The shoe? It is hard to fix <gasps> what has been broken. The arrow of time only moves in one direction. Wait. What did you say? The arrow of time? That's it! The time capsule from six years ago! If we could dig that up... Huh? Mizuki? Where are you going? I think it was around here somewhere. Yep, right here. There it is! Indeed. Lian, can you go grab a shovel? Well, that was out of nowhere. You're gonna bury a dead body or something? No, I'm going to dig something up. A dead body? <laughs> no, the time capsule. Time. Capsule. <sighs> the shoes are still in good condition. The letters, too. Why don't you read it? <laughs> Right now? Do you want to bury it for another six years? <sighs> okay, then. I... Oh, are we? Oh, we're carrying it. What's wrong? This is kind of embarrassing. <laughs> Just do it. To Kizzy. I love you, Kizzy. I really, 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 really love you. When I first saw you, I seriously thought an angel descended from heaven. I was thunderstruck. At that moment, I decided to devote my life to you. The glass slippers that I put in the capsule are a symbol of my never-ending love for you. To me, six years in the future. I'll never forgive you if you make Kizzy cry. I'm gonna fly to you and punch her stupid face. Whatever happens, always be by her side. When she's struggling or in pain, support her with everything you got. Even if your feelings aren't reciprocated, Make sure she's always smiling. Make sure you dedicate your life to her happiness. That is my request to you. You're up next, Kizzy. Here. But, but... No buts. Read. Fine. We... <laughs> <laughs> to me, six years from now, how do you truly feel toward him? I still do not know exactly how to feel about him, but no matter how I might feel in the future, the most important thing is to be true to yourself. It is not becoming of me to play games with a man's heart. If you think no, you need to tell him no. It would be better for him. But if you do have feelings for him... I'm sorry, Leon. Sorry? Is that a rejection? No, I meant about earlier. I took out my frustration on you, and I am sorry for that. I should not be placing my anger on people I care about. If it is acceptable to you, if you do not mind, but I am the way I am. Lian, will you? Kizzy, it's like I said before, six years have gone by. But my feelings haven't changed. My love is eternally undying. I myself have changed. What do you mean? 
My feelings have changed over the last six years. Leon, I... I love you. You are my Prince Charming. Kizzy? Kizzy? Hey, is that the end of that? <laughs> Mizuki, why are you here anyway? Oh, right. <laughs> so I asked Lin if I had overlooked everything from last night. He quickly told me that I had it. Why did we even come here? <laughs> it's fine. We made them happy. Uh, it's good Thank you. It is all thanks to you, Big Sis. But I do not know how Father is going to take this news. That is my only concern. But I am an adult now. I will oh. solve this on my own. Bitch. Totally. Thank you, Mizuki. The day started with seeing all those awful things. Kizzy was on the brink of hating me. It could have been the worst day of my life, but now it's become the best day of my life. Oh, you mean because we were in Horidori Institute past midnight? Hmm? Yeah, that too. That <laughs> too? Iba, can I wink sink into Leon? Oh. I will not protest. But why? I got a feeling. I think Leon is hiding something. Hmm. Yeah? <clears throat> Yeah, we haven't synced in yet, right? Yeah. Hey, is this for real? Why are you surprised? You didn't know? Well, I guess that makes sense. If you knew, you wouldn't have asked me to open the lock and see what's inside. What did all that mean? Unknown. Leon must have seen something that shocked him. That must be what he was referring to earlier. Okay. I'm gonna get going now. I wish both of you eternal happiness. S stop it, Big Sis. I'm gonna make Kizzy the happiest girl in the world. No, the whole universe! Leon. <laughs> Mizuki. What do you want to do about Leon? About the wink sink? I mean, it is concerning, but I think we should focus on our investigation. Understood. Let us proceed to the next location. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. Brahman, how are we going to Mama? Oh, again. Okay. So what are you oh, oh, I wanted to talk Sorry. to Mame. We're kind of busy right now, so can you make it quick? Oh, I'm not here for you, Genny. I meant Amame is busy. Genny, are you mad about something? No, not at all. You seem a little mad. As you can see, I'm all smiles as usual. <laughs> okay. So, Mame, can we talk for a little bit? Oh, um, yeah. Okay. Mommy doesn't seem to be doing well. Are you... are you not feeling well? Yeah, I haven't really been doing well recently. But it's okay. Oh. Don't worry about it. I thought you Dory Institute. Horidori Institute? What's that? I'm not familiar. Okay. How about nice? I know the name. <clears throat> I saw it on some occult website, but I don't know anything more than that. Okay. But in one I should have. Sorry. But like I said before, I... I don't really know any of the details. I just looked it up online. Hey again. Why are you in the bad mood? Like I said, fine. I'm just focusing on work, that's all. Uh, I brought you the institute. You asked me that like you were asking for a glass of water. That facility. It's a really touchy subject for me. It's not something I want to casually discuss here. If you really want to know, at least wait until after work. Mm. Nice. Uh, I've heard about some group like that, yeah, but I don't really know anything about it. Okay, but they about initiative. What is that? I've never even heard of it. I <laughs> barely got anything. Mizuki, take a look at this. Are you lying? Mame, not just her. 
again as well. Mm. What do you think? Okay. They are both hiding something. Guess they why, gave us oh, no why. choice. Let's have a look. Yes. Thinking which one, which one? Sorry, Kenny. I shouldn't have told you. It's okay, Amame. I made an oath. I will protect you with my life, so don't you worry about a thing. Okay. Interesting. Amame must have told Gen something very important. Perhaps a secret. <laughs> oh, we're doing sync, both of them, okay? Hold on. Both? I require charging between wink sinks. Can't we use the backup? You mean like I did for Kizuna and Lian? Those were special circumstances. Come on, just do it. Jesus. <sighs> Fine. But I did warn you. <sighs> what do I do? I have to obey. I... Ooh. Help me, Dad. You're watching from heaven, right? So please... Uh, May. She also mentioned her father. Watching from heaven. Right. I thought you're. Oh, uh, okay. Very touchy, but okay. But your dad. Um, Mame. Yeah. This might be a touchy <laughs> subject, but your dad, is he deceased? Yes. Six oh. years ago. Okay. So that is the situation. Yeah, the two of them are hiding something important. Indeed. Oh, by the way, this is all your fault. Huh? I am out uh -oh. of battery. Hey, wait! Aiba! Aiba! Oh, oh, I need to head to work now. Huh? And I need to go shopping. I'm low on ingredients. Wait! Bye! Goodbye. Mm. Ugh, what is going on? Right. Next to Lemnus Gate. I'm going to meet that big booba lady in again. Big boob? Oh. <laughs> yeah, the reception is. <laughs> the valley girl. I thought you meant the big milky balls. <laughs> oh! What? Kiss me, Mizuki! What? I just realized um. this. <clears throat> Kiss me, Mizuki is a palindrome. No, it isn't. Hey, didn't think the president herself would show up. Yeah, I'm not here for work today. Investigating the case? Yeah, I'm doing some questioning. Based on Lemnus Gate's schedule, I knew Iris would be here. So I wanted to come talk. Okay, just a sec. I know this guy. This is one of, uh... What's the guy's name in the Yakuza? Moma! This is one of Moma's friends. Stop! Do not interact with him. What? Why? Why not? I recognize him. Yeah. He is a Kumakura, but there is something abnormal about him. What do you want? You got a problem? No, I was just wondering what you were doing here. Why am I here? Duh, Yomante. Iomante? Hit it in the head and you can hear the sound of civilization. <laughs> Curry rice, school bag, she's Shamo hell. Hey, what? Wake what up, old man Shamo. Old man Shamo. Old man Shamo. Old man Shamo. Gregory, Gregory. Greco Roman style. Oh, he's what? I told you not to talk to him. Oh, wait, I'm normal. Oh. <laughs> what is ah, wrong with him? He's basically He's basically normal. <laughs> wait, the thing came. What the fuck's wrong with him? What? Anemone aliens are attacking? This isn't good. We need a Mr. Bear. Vroom, vroom. Hurry. We need to fly to Yosemite National Park. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <Pepperoncino>. <laughs> Let's pretend we didn't see any of that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Reception is um working hard. Of course. 
I always give it my hundo percent. Like when one of those big shot producer guys comes in here, I greet them at the desk naked. Yeah, you're fired. Aw, come on. Bring me on full time. I don't think so. Okay, um, hello. Oh, Perez, you look cute today. Cutest in the whole wide world. <laughs> Can you raise my salary? <laughs> nah. <laughs> Um. Are you trying to seduce me into going to a Tommy with you? Huh? No. There's a receptionist sitting behind the desk. Oh, uh, are we doing it again? There's a receptionist with huge breasts <laughs> sitting behind the desk. <laughs> the receptionist with huge breasts is sitting. The big titty Breast. receptionist. <laughs> big titty. Titty. There are titty. big titties sitting behind the desk. Are you malfunctioning? <laughs> <laughs> That's it. <laughs> um, it's Iris, our top money maker. She's full of energy. She's full Any information? I'm not an informant, you know. I know, but you're always on top of gossip and rumors. Well, if that's what you're looking for... You got something? Remember when I told you about the video two days ago? The Nirvana trial, right? And that many people have gone missing after watching the video. Yeah, that! I heard there's something big going down. Something big? Well, recently we've been hearing rumors from all over Japan. <laughs> Bunch of people have started acting really weird. That is accurate. National news stations are beginning to report on this phenomenon. Well, what do you mean by acting weird? Like people who start dancing for no reason, smash glass windows in stores. Some people have been reported rolling up and down the streets or hitting their heads on light poles. Standing in the middle of an intersection for tens of hours. Running into a wall over and over and They're over fun. again. Bug? <laughs> and also, People jumping. Yeah. Jumping off. Oh, rooftops. I mean, lag? <laughs> Is there a word lagging? Are you saying this was all caused by the Nirvana trial? Yeah. All those people started acting strangely after watching the video. I bet. Does that video have some kind of mind control effect? No, it does not. After all, you saw the video as well. Good point. And I'm as normal as ever. You sure? Are you sure about that? <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> you sure? Hey, about that guy. What's he doing here? I don't know. He was here when I got- There's something oh. wrong Sorry. with him. Is he doing hard drugs or something? Shh! He'll hear you! And he did! Yeah. Oh no, he's coming over. Told you! Oh! You saw the video too? Oh. What? The Nirvana. What? I did. Um. Yeah. So you must have went there. Where? Where? Let me just tell you this. The practice run <laughs> will be done on the rooftop of Misata. Later. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Oh, glad nothing happened. Okay. I wonder if he saw the video too. Seems so. So the rumors were true. Watching the video makes you go crazy? Yeah. I am curious about what he said. The practice run will be done on the rooftop of Misatot. But then again, calling him scatterbrained would be charitable. We probably do not need to put too much stock into what he said. Thinking about it isn't gonna get us anywhere. Anyway, Iris and Ota, I'm gonna get going. Oh, okay, wait. see ya. Have we lost Ota yet? Good luck with the investigation. <laughs> Hold on. Da -da -da. Huh? Did you want to ask me something? Nope, not at all. Oh, come on. Can't you ask me something like, why are you here? Just Iris? Up, eh? You're just waiting for Iris, aren't you? Yeah, <laughs> yeah you nailed it. <laughs> Stupid on top of this stupid here, okay. Um, where to go, where to Kamakura! Oh yeah! We did have that voice changer, right? From him? Yeah. <laughs> uh, From... Momo. Hey, Mizuki, yeah. what are you here for? I'm investigating the HB case. I was hoping to get some new information. Ah, uh, new info, huh? Uh... <laughs> hey, Mizuki! Does looking at that lantern give you ideas? Give me ideas. Uh, <laughs> like fear or something? No. Uh oh. I, I see. Oh, nothing. <laughs> okay. 
I would solve the lanterns. Well, we, well, you know, usually when we click interact with this, it always comes with a sex joke. <laughs> Alright. Oh, we sync. Okay. Oh. Hey, everyone. Let me introduce my beautiful wife. It's oh. Iris Saga. Okay. No, honey. We're married now, so it's <clears throat> Iris Kumakura, isn't it? <laughs> You're right. Hello, everyone. I'm Iris Kumakura. Nice to meet you. I fell in love with Yuma's masculine manliness, so I just had to marry him. Yes! Yeah, Mama's imagination is running wild. <laughs> he might be going crazy, too. Okay. Um, what were you doing here, Alan? What do you think I'm doing? I'm watching Tessa's new video. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, I want some. Inf I want some information. Well, let's <clears throat> see. I don't know if this is related to the HB case, but at Iowin, the joint run by Richie Chieda, a long time ago, one of their kids went yeah, missing. Yeah, we already heard about There's that. There's a rumor that Shikara Horadori had something to do with it. You mean he oh, kidnapped okay. the child? I don't know. But I do know that Shakara's been doing shady shit for a while. Went around the country doing DNA <clears throat> examinations of children. Plus all that sketchy research he was doing. Maybe he was using the kids as part of his research or something. Maybe combining bodies. Combining bodies? Oh. Okay, that's weird. What do you mean by combining bodies? I don't know, like cutting two bodies in half right yep. down the middle? And then you combine the left half of one with uh. the right half of the other? Uh. What? Hold on, why would they do that? I don't know. No way of knowing what's going on inside some nut job's head. Anyway, Chikara was supposed to be doing shit like that. And that's definitely related to the HB case. Yeah, maybe. It seems that Shikara really was attempting the experiment <clears throat> Mama described. That would explain the machines in the basement. And why there were two. Oh yeah, I fucking forgot that it, it was on the territory. Damn. How much time do I have left? Uh, we got like three minutes left. Thanks, Mama. Yeah. I think what you told me might turn out to be a big help. Nah, no, don't thank me. Okay. Instead of thanks, no, I know what you want. No, Bring no, Tessa no, no. with you next time. I'll think about it. All right, <laughs> I'm looking forward. <laughs> uh, but give a call out in this case. Oh, that's Dr. Oh, yeah. Yogano. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's a Tessa fan, too. Probably why he was at Lemnus Gate. No, it didn't seem like that was why. Oh, what do you mean? There was <clears throat> something wrong with him. He was acting strange. Well, yeah, he's always like that. Don't worry about it. I mean, he is the kind of guy who'll bust out a Gatling gun and start shooting at the drop of a hat. Okay. Okay. Um, and next, Marble. Oh, we're going to sing Mama. Mickey Balls. E. <laughs> Oh, great, and oh, milky balls. Drinking early, I see. I need to ride later, so I'm not drinking. Also, I'm underage. <laughs> I'm just joking. You're here to gather some intel, right? Hmm, uh, okay. Um, uh, what do you think? <clears throat> Here's a question. If you get it, I'll buy you a drink. Okay. What's something that hangs down the middle of a man? They come in different shapes and sizes, too. Um... <laughs> what is it, Mama? Tell us. Wow. A necktie? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> I was talking about wieners. Uh. <laughs> 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 I'm sorry, but I don't have anything for you. If anything, I want some answers from you. About what? Well, about Jin's <clears throat> left half being found at the stadium three days ago. Oh, I can't tell you anything about that. Could his body have traveled through time? That's impossible. 
uh, I didn't tell her about uh, one wheel thing. Ah, uh, Robert. It would take a while to explain. There's something fishy about that stadium. <clears throat> Maybe there's some <coughs> strange device hidden there. Think about it. They've been doing construction there for half a year. They said something about some issues with the structure. Maybe that's just a cover. And they're really working on something else. Like what? Like a time portal to teleport Jin's left half from six years ago. It feels like Mama has changed ever since she started telling fortunes. I don't remember her talking about occult stuff like that. Hmm. Okay. I about Christabel? about the Christabel? Hmm. What about them? Oh, nothing important. Crystal is just kind of meaningful to me. How so? That's what I was named after. Crystal and Kanji can be read as Mizuki. That's what Daddy told me a long time ago. That's beautiful. I think it fits you perfectly. Though, I guess it wasn't his idea. Uh, uh about the other institute? Horidori Institute, huh? <laughs> oh! I remember. You know that they were closed down once, about 15 years ago, right? The underground was abuzz with rumors about them doing some sketchy research. Rumor is, the one who leaked the story was Richie Chieda. Mr. Chieda? Richie Chieda is a major stakeholder at Horidori Institute. Yeah. He must have had plenty of opportunities to gather insider info. He's the chairman of an orphanage, you know. He really does love children, so maybe he decided he couldn't turn a blind eye. Oh, uh. Thanks, Mama. If anything comes up, be sure to tell me. You're welcome. Uh, by the way, Mizuki, any boyfriends? Uh, that came out of nowhere. I was just hoping for an introduction, is all. Mm -hmm. Uh, <laughs> unfortunately, not right now. Not right now. I go to an all-girls school. Finding a boyfriend there would be pretty difficult. What? Okay, okay. <laughs> I should have gone to college. <laughs> oh well. Come back soon. And next time, get a ride from someone. Hmm? I told you I'm not drinking! <laughs> okay, and that's it for today's episode. Oh, uh, well... Okay then. <laughs> <laughs> That's all for now, everybody. See you next time. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Good night. Bye.